Hidden in a remote French village we find this beautiful abandoned mansion with everything left inside. We had no information on the property or its former owners, but from exploring the home, we found it was once owned by a rich and wealthy family. We discovered the mansion was abandoned in 2013, and the family have nothing to do with the property or any of the possessions left inside. Inside we find the family's whole life left frozen in time from when they left nearly a decade ago. Children's toys, wardrobes full of clothes and the beds still left made. A family's full life left to decay. Finding homes like this leaves more questions than answers. Why did they abandon their home? Where did they go? and why has no one claimed the family's possessions ever since? Join us as we take a look inside and see what remains. Okay guys, so we are in the chateau now, out in the middle of nowhere complete woods around the place look at this guys absolutely full to the brim quite hoarder in this area but as we move through the house you are going to see a difference the house has been abandoned for five or six years but check this out it is so dark in here this looks like a proper entertaining room piano there music sheets desks look at this library just completely left the family photographs from different parties and stuff like that baby photographs look at the statues along the top of this piano insane like I say music sheets everything does look in quite good condition not too much damage in the place the big shutters on the windows still like I say, in only five or six years, this place has been left. It's absolutely huge. This is crazy, guys. Look at the dust gathering on these leather chairs now. Look at that. That is insane. Like we were saying, full library. All the little bits and bobs on the... Uh, on the shelves, trinkets. All little mementos from different holidays and stuff like that. You can see it's actually overflowed onto the floor there. Obviously this is where the family members sat, read their books. Complete encyclopedias in this cupboard. Full works going on in here. Look at this little button collection, that's cute. Check that out. Look into their room there though, we'll go there next. All statues, ornaments along the shelves. Look how old these books are here. Dust all over them. And then over to the writing desk. Pictures of the family. Wow, this is a beautiful house. Must have had some money. I'm telling you. Insane. Look at the chandelier. Cobwebs over it now. The nice ceiling rose. Definitely had some money. Let's head into the next room. All the furniture still left. Look at this little portable TV. Black and white, I'm guessing. The hedgehog toy next to it. Ah, there is some graffiti on the doors. Baphomet. People obviously coming in and doing some sort of satanic rituals. Look in these cupboards, so just completely full of VHS tapes. Wow. Hundreds of them. 
Same again here, a few more books here as well. Wow. Jewelry still here. This is insane that this is just left abandoned. Some kids' toys, shields there. But definitely a wealthy family once lived here. Look at all the handwritten. Is that like a phone book? Must have been around Christmas time too, Christmas decorations. But look at this, chairs. Look at the detail in this armchair. Wow, it's quite dark in this place. Can't really help that. The statues. Whew. Honestly guys, so lucky to be able to explore places like this. Big fireplace. The Deirdre Barlow's on the side. More family photographs. These old books here as well, just sitting here. Crazy. Big high ceilings, another chandelier. What do we have in here? What's in this cupboard? Ah, just heads into the next room there. We'll, we'll go through the other way there. But this is crazy that this is just left like this. Family, it looks like it's definitely left in a hurry. More oh, artwork up, eh? A journal? Oh wow, 1912, yeah. Look at the writing though, it's proper fucking old school writing. It is, that's wild good, isn't it? How cool is that? It's like a record book, right. isn't it? All the prices are... Crazy. Nice, eh? Nice house. Right, let's push forward. It's a big house. We are on a time limit today. Right, we're back into the hallway. Look at this tiled floor. And the big winding staircase spiralling around there. It's strange how all the clothes and that have all been left in this front entrance. Zimmer frame there, stuff like that. Does look like somebody's been through and had a route here. Wow, check that big fire. Probably heated most of the house there. Cobwebs hanging down. Looks like this is where they probably sat and had their meals in this room. But somebody has been through. Looking for valuables, you can tell. Old mobile phones on the table, etc. Oh, check out this. La Radio Technique. So strange. Let's have a quick look in these rooms. This is just like a small office area. You can see he would have sat there and done some work looking out the window there. Guys, outside it is so overgrown. I am going to show you when we're leaving. I'm going to try and get some drone shots because this place is so big. I don't think I'm going to be able to pass it off on the video. So we're going to head down this way now, back into the hallway. Look at these curved walls wrapping around. Wow. Check this kitchen, guys. It's quite a modern house compared to what we are used to. We do delve into the more modern stuff though now and again. Look at this though. Religious pieces on the wall. Family photographs. Ah, there you go. August 2013 it was left. So, nine years. This has been abandoned. You can really tell as well with the dust and the damp in the place. Cookers there. Herbs and spices up on the wall. Some more there as well. Just looks like a pantry back here. All food in there. Completely left. This is crazy guys, sinks, quite a modern tumble dryer there as well, look at this, proper medieval style, look at the cobwebs hanging over these glasses and vases, does look like some fire damage on the fireplace there, wow, 
pots and pans still hung up. You see this quite a bit with the stone worktops where they do the washing up. Absolutely loving this place guys. Amazing how this has been left like this. Only nine years. Right guys, level number one done. We're gonna head upstairs, check the bedrooms out. But this is crazy that this has been left like this. Like we said, August 2013, this place was abandoned. And it's just been left ever since. Massive, it? it is massive, mate. Yeah, it's huge. There's just rooms that just keep going off rooms and going off rooms and going off rooms. That's what we like, lad. It does look like older people live there. You've got this stair lift. All right, let's head up. Check out these bedrooms. Bedroom number one. Oh, look at this, guys. Like an office art room. All the trinkets left on the side. See if there's any clothes in this wardrobe. Oh yeah, look at that guy, it's completely full. Women's clothes there. Somebody has definitely been through routing. See the clothes that are thrown all over the floor here. Drawers have been tipped over. But look at this little art desk. Still got her paints and pencils on the side. All her paints in the box still. See the little paintings that the children have done. Wow. Proper artist's house. The fake flowers on the side. All the paints that have been left. Children's pictures. More family photographs. See them stood at the Eiffel Tower there. And then we've got the bed next to it. With a map of the United States up on the wall. Bit random, being in France. But probably had dreams of going there one day, maybe becoming an artist. It does look like a, a young girl's room, maybe a teenage girl's room. Cartoons up on the wall there. Check these books just hidden behind this doorway. Just one pan of this room before we leave. Look at this, guys. See the sun coming through there as well. Absolutely amazing place. Loving it. Let's see what else we've got. Back out into this hallway, there's the stair lift. Got some children's scooters, wardrobes. Crazy that this is just in the hallway though. Probably ran out of room. There's a wig there as well, but I won't be touching that. It's been sat here for years. Perfumes. Like I was saying, clothes have been around, thrown everywhere. People have definitely been in loot in this place. But still, some of these rooms are absolutely amazing. Oh wow, check this out. Check this room out, guys. A baby's cot in the corner. Another toddler's bed. And then the big oak bed here. Probably for mum and dad. Look at the artwork up. Still up on the walls. Bit skew with like, but at least it's still here. There is a secret door there. Hidden behind this cot. We'll go through there in a sec, but look at this, guys. Still got the teddies in there. Oh my days. Got the old radios on the side here. This is crazy that this has been left. Look at the age of this one here. Like I said, the toddler's bed. Children's bed. Little ornaments on the side, cassettes too. Wow. Right, let's check out uh, what's behind that hidden door, because that's interesting. Oh, the cots on wheels too. What do we have here? 
Oh, it's an ensuite bathroom and a walk in wardrobe. Clothes still hung up. Jackets on the side. How crazy is this? They've made it like a proper secret room. The sink's definitely seen better days. Quite a modern shower. More clothes just thrown in there. Look at the shutters that you see in France. Absolutely amazing. I love them. We are going to put this back now just in case. I don't want to move anything. There we go. Perfect. Exactly how we found it. More family photographs down the bottom there. Definitely a more wealthy family. Bedroom number three. Someone's written 666 on the door there. Such a shame when these vandals get to places like this and they just throw the stuff everywhere. Honestly is quite upsetting. I know we come in and we film places but we barely touch anything. We do leave everything how we found it. We're literally documenting what we find. And then people come in and just trash the place, draw all over everything. It's a shame like so much to see it's hard to know where to start but we've got a female's clothes in this wardrobe as well look at this i love the wallpaper in this place proper retro this looks like another teenager's room see the disco lights rollerblades skates like i was saying people have just been in just throwing stuff all over this bed more clothes there is this the girl? Is this the girl that lived here? Definitely think so. CDs on the side. All documents. We're not going to go through there because of addresses. But this is crazy. See somebody's began painting this wall and just given up. So weird to think why this place was abandoned all of a sudden. Why are all the why is all the stuff left behind? It is a strange one. We are going to head over and check out this next room now. Oh wow, look at the size of this bathroom. Wow, this is huge. Wardrobes in the bathroom here. All absolutely full. We will have a look inside. All the lotions and potions here. Tanning, all stuff like that. Definitely a few females lived here. Look at this kid's toy. That's pretty cool. Oh, look at this. All dressing gowns and pyjamas hung up in here. Actually a good way of doing it. But look at this bath. The freestanding baths. Somebody has been throwing stuff in there. Definitely seen better days. The vase is on the wall, on the wall, on the sh thing, <laughs> a bidet, we love a bidet. The kids toys just in the sink. I think that's behind the wardrobe in there, but another dressing gown with initials on it. Crazy this. Look how high the ceilings are, the doors. Let's move through to the next room. See what we can find in here. Oh wow. Check this out guys. Artwork. Dresses hung on these mannequins. Tops, sequins. Look at this dress. It's quite fancy isn't it? Quite a fancy dress. All the files. Probably portfolios. All in these wardrobes and cupboards. Is that a French singer? Schwengnor. Schwengnor. I don't know, guys. Do not quote me on that. But look at the paintings still left. Flowers. Nice fireplace in here. Marble. Do see a lot of that here in France. Just looking at this picture now. Is that a grandfather or great-grandfather? Looks quite old, that one. More paintings. I've seen the same initial pretty much on all the pictures and it's the same one from that room with the art stuff in there so they're probably proud of her work and hung it around the house 
in all the different rooms. More little trinkets on the side. Little bits and bobs in this cupboard which has been cleared out it looks like, which is a shame. Oh look at this military style jacket, that's pretty cool. Just hung up in the corner here. And more artwork. Look at the garden though guys, completely overgrown there. Whew, completely big double bed. That is the ensuite from the other bathroom as well, other bedroom. That goes into the first bedroom that we've seen. All the stuff's been thrown everywhere there. Such a shame. But we do have one more bedroom to check out and then on to the next floor. Last room on this floor now. Mm -hmm. They all in here. Good going guys. This is insane this one mate. Yeah, nice isn't it? Look at the old prams this mate. Was, this was definitely the mum and dad's room. Yeah. <laughs> Four poster bed, prams. Yeah, that's vintage prams. La vintage. La vintage. It's crazy, isn't it? All the marble fireplaces in France. You reckon this might be her? There is a quite a lot of modelling shots knocking yeah, around. I think they were really like artistic, weren't they? Like looking at it, there's like an art room. Yeah. There's uh, there's loads of like clay models downstairs and stuff. I don't know if you got that, but yeah. they're not amazingly interesting. But that you can see they've been made. Yeah, and the craft room with yeah. the dresses. It's crazy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Definitely well off. I know. Look at the teddies hanging here, mate. Is that a photo? Yeah, I'll have a look now. Well. Rocking horses. Children's toys. A drawer in there. Yeah, it's not as good as the others, to be fair. <laughs> Child just out. Yeah, maybe an early piece. Maybe, hang on. Yeah, look, this is her. This looks like the mum when she was younger and she looks more like the the daughter now. Oh, oh look at these family. Look, these are from Innerdale. That's the dining room downstairs with the big table. Oh, yeah. Look, there it is. That's the uh, like flume thing. No way. How crazy is this seeing people living in here? Wow. Out in the garden there. Look at all fancy dress and stuff. No way. <laughs> <laughs> Did she have a bottle in her mouth dressed as a baby on the next one? Where? <laughs> <laughs> Giving me Princess Diana vibes. Yeah. Oh look, they've got guns, so <laughs> let's be a bit quicker. That's fine. Right. Yeah, it looks in this picture. Maybe just it out somewhere. Yeah, crazy this, isn't it though? Yeah, it is nice. Good double bed, four poster bed. Wow. I'm looking at life, honestly. Another craft table here. This is definitely a kids' room day, it's yeah, gotta be. 100%, yeah, I was just joking before. Huh. <laughs> it's got the toys. Like, like, you know when you're rich and you're getting your kids' books of the corpses and yeah. human anatomy, do you know what I mean? And they've got just random grand fireplaces. I was re reading like Clifford the Big Red Dog and yeah, Biff yeah. and Chip. I couldn't even read those <laughs> things. <laughs> this is crazy. More artwork, you can see. Like oil paintings of these, I'm not sure. But postcards, photographs of the family all left. I think this is the girl that lived in this room. Well, I didn't live in this room. This was her room. She's the same girl from the picture in the other room too. Wow. All paperwork. It must be a big family that lived here. Books on the side, bookshelves. The Grand Blue. But this is crazy. Just check this room out, guys. Get a pan of this. With the prams, rocking horses, kids' toys. All just left here. Have you seen little springy things on wheels? The what? Before? Like little springy things on wheels. What do you mean? I just keep seeing them everywhere. That'd be some sort of kid toy, wouldn't it? Yeah, I wonder what it is though. Yeah, let me have a look. Oh yeah, if anyone knows what that is guys, let us know in the comments. That is, it's a bit I've random, never seen it? that before. Is There's there? loads of them in here though. Is there? Yeah. There's a secret room there, Dale. I know. It's a just, toilet. I know, yeah. <laughs> right, should we head up? You shouldn't be in here. Oh, it's the dibbles. <laughs> right, one more floor. One more floor, guys. 
lovely stars. Ah, oh, there's rooms coming off the stairs here. Wow. What do we have in here then? Ah, oh, just another bathroom. But it's still quite cool to see. Look at this. Right, heading up. Oh my days, look at this attic. Completely full. Oh, I'm not even going to be able to move around up here. But there's magazines, photo albums. Literally the family's whole life just left up here to decay. You can actually see sunlight coming through the roof as well. So this is not going to last whatsoever. Wow. Look at the big skylight here. I've got more rooms. Children's artwork. Oh my days. It's absolutely massive. Let's head down this way. We'll start down this way and work our way back. Wow, another bedroom. It's been absolutely ransacked though. What a shame that is. But just a little neat corner of the room with this lamp. Ornaments on the side. Descartes. I'm not sure who he is. But he's got a right haircut. Um, more plants. Oh, chairs. This house is so big, guys. It's unreal. Nice homely vibes in here. Not really bad vibes at all. It is just so strange how a whole family like this has vanished. Like, literally, we don't have any history on this house whatsoever. They've just literally disappeared. Left everything behind in here. You can see all toys, children's toys. Like, sometimes when, like, a family member would pass away, it gets passed on to the children. No idea where the children are in this case. There is obviously a lot of children about as well. See all the art, all the pictures, the kids' rooms. So no idea where they have actually gone. Now we're just moseying about in their attic, having a look around. Trying to get clues to dates, what we did see 2013. Wow. It's quite eerie walking down with the... Uh, children's pictures on the walls and like I said another room that's just been completely ransacked oh wow completely full here this is insane I wish I knew where the family had gone okay explorers so that's the house Dale did mention something about a basement so I am just gonna have a walk down and check that out see if we can find anything on the way down I'm gonna get pictures for Instagram so head over there and check that out Adam Mark explores I am gonna get some cinematics for the video and we'll meet you down there guys see you in a sec basement just down there let's go it's like a little secret doorway this oh, one. Yeah. Don't go in that one, whatever you do. <laughs> oh, here? Yeah, down there. Oh, I smell that. Oh. Clean rods. Oh, my days, look at this. Oh, it's a pr proper tunnel. Look at this, guys. Hidden under the house. Wow. Oh, wow. Check this out, guys. See the boiler. Wow. Right, look at all this that's been left down here. All old tools, suitcases. There's garlic down here for some reason. But it's just been thrown everywhere. But I'm trying to get over to here where the wine is. I want to check this out. Look at this. Hey, I've seen these all over France. Shells everywhere. Can someone explain to me what the shells are? We've got food in jars down here. Litres and litres of wine. Look at the dust settling over these bottles. Jams. Old jars. It seems like a lot of these French places did like to prep. Keep hold of all their stuff. Look at the bottles, guys. Just sat down here. Absolutely amazing. Loving this place. Absolutely love this place. Look at the cobwebs. 
but it's so cool that these you can see where they've been like dug out and cemented you can actually see like the trowel marks so this is cool loving this we do love a basement here and what an amazing find this is right guys that's the whole house we're gonna head upstairs now get some drone shots see you up there so the other explorers inside this beautiful French mansion. No idea what happened to the family. Seems like they've completely vanished. No history on the place, but what an amazing house this has been. Artwork, the dresses, just everything left completely behind. All the kids' toys, the rocking horses, amazing place. Really hope you've enjoyed it, guys. We are on to the next one. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit notification for future explorers. And yeah, hope you have a good week. All the fruity stuff. All the fruity stuff. Peace out, guys. Peace Take out. Easy. Let's go.